Hey, good looking. Welcome back to the channel. If you want to see how I got my Davina shadows going from this to looking like this right here, it's good organization going on. Just keep watching. I'm Kendra Morgan official and I like to put out content around single eyeshadows, makeup, brushes, sunscreen. So if you like that kind of content, please be sure to, to, su to, su <laughs> to subscribe. I've got the Davina website pulled up here. We're just going to go and organize by groups, by collections. <clears throat> I know I have the Halo Moon collection, so we'll start with that one. I believe there are all these iridescent ones. Right here. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Proteus. Um, oh, great. It's in pink and I can't read it. I think I can get most of them out, though. Marema. I guess here we are. We're going to be doing some swatches as well. I don't really have this set up to do swatches, but I will be doing swatches out of all my special shades when I organize them. So, all right. I got this little guy here. Maybe I should be using this. Zira. Yeah, it just takes it out so much better. This is Island. There are six, it looks like. And this one is Nokomis. Hopefully I'm saying these correctly. Yep, those are six of the... Um, this is the... Halo Moon Collection. Let's go ahead and get to the next collection. Next collection, Carnival Sweets, which has Bubble Fizz, Butter Pucker. Uh, looks like this is one of them. Is this Marshmallow Pillows? That's not it. Sprinkle Whip Sour Spanx. Where are all of these? Okay, this is Kazookles. That's not it either. This has got to be one of them right here. Swudge. No, where are all these? All right, they've got to be taken out as I go because you got to see this. I don't understand. Like, oops. This is Everlasting Gobstopper. It's not even one of them. Oops. It's the other one. I know it is. Okay, what do they look like? They're all like pinky purples. This has got to be one. Runts. No. Not even close. This is Pixie Sticks. Is this one of them? No. This is a duochrome. This has got to be one of them. I just know it. Cream Puff Cuddles. No. I don't even have this collection. Okay, let's move on to something that I do know what's what on, and that is the Aurora Flares. So we've got Thermosphere. I don't know what this collection is, folks, but it's not what I thought it was. There's Borealis, Polaris, uh, Magnetosphere, Eggs' View. Oops. That's gorgeous. Look at that. that. That's a mixture of something else in there, but, you know, still, you get the point. It's gorgeous. Australis. I do have the new one, the new ones, Hemisphere and Chromosphere, I think are what they are called, or Phenomenon and Hemisphere, which are these two right here, and this is Chromosphere. I think I got them all. Well, that was easy. Okay, and then next let's do the Star Chasers. I'm pretty fluent with them. Those are Orion. Let me just confirm that I am getting, yeah. Then I need, actually, I think some of these, uh, Vela Lynx is right here. And then I have two, this one right here is one as well, Draco. And the other one looks very similar to Draco. I think it's this one. Oh my goodness, I can't pick them up. Aquila, yeah. And is there five? No, there's six. This one might also be one as well. Confetti Kisses. No, that's not it. I'm missing Altair. It does look similar to this one, so it's got to be up in here somewhere. Oh, I think it's this one right here. Nope. There it is. Altair. 
All right, next up will be the Candy Cakes collection, which I think is what I thought that that other Carnival Sweets collection was that I had. So this is the one that's got Mystic Moon Pie, which is probably one of my favorite. I think it's this one right here. Yep, that's Mystic Moon Pie. That's one of my favorites. Then it also has, does it have Asteria? I don't think it does. Rainbow something, I think it's this one. Is Sweetie Sunbeam one of them? Oh, Confetti Kisses is. Cream Puff Cuddles. <laughs> That's where that one came from. This is the one. Cream Puff Cuddles. Then this yellow one is Pancake Bubbles. Ooh, we're getting somewhere now. Uh, Runts, that's not in it. But then there's a rainbow something. It's kind of green. Um, maybe I should just start using this. The Celesta and Are You a Good Witch? I think they discontinued this one right here. But I will... I mean, they're all Wizard of Oz themed. So hopefully... This is Confetti Kisses. This is also in the Sweet Shops collection. Or no, this is... Is this, oh, this is Candy Cakes Collection, excuse me. Aha, there you are. Rainbow Bubbles. Yeah, I'm cute. Rainbow Blossom, excuse me. All right, and I've got one more, and I think it's, it's orange. Yeah, I'm kind of needing this orange shade right here. Sweetie Sunbeam. Yep, there it is. This is probably one of my favorite collections that they made. Just because I think the shadows are somewhat wearable on an everyday basis. And they've got a lot of texture and like glitter to them, which is very helpful with special shade matching. Okay, so I think that the collection that I have is Sugar Drops collection. So that would be... Cake Balm, Soda Swamp, Puffles, Taffy Balm, Gumbles, Yum Licks, Shuggies, Cavies, and Boom Sour. But where's the Pixie Stick? That's got to be the Wonka collection that I have. Kazookles? Is that one? No, it's not. It's kind of an iridescent group. All right, I'm gonna gather myself. This is actually a little harder than I thought it was gonna be. This is Tucana. This is a Galaxy Dust Shifters or whatever. And Centaurus. I'm also collecting all of those Galaxy Explorers, whatever they're called exactly. I can't quite recall what they were called, but they're they're kind of easy to pick out. Cygnus is one of them, I'm pretty sure. The L, Asteria is one. I use them quite frequently when I do palettes. So if you are looking for special shadows and other Messier, I thought this was part of this duochrome collection down here, but I guess not. Maybe it's up here. Okay, the rest of these are going to be pretty easy. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, I think that also goes up there. It was like a really expensive Skyla. That's pretty. All right, let's move into getting all of the Wizard of Oz ones. So I'll be tender, I'll be gentle. I know that one's like from the Wizard of Oz. And then they've got ding a Deary, which is I'm pretty sure also one of them. I don't, I actually don't know if this is one of them or not. Nakara, I don't think that is. Gallus. No Place Like Home. That's pretty. I don't know if you guys can see that shift, but that's really pretty. There's Are You a Good Witch. That dupes out one of the shades, I think, in uh, my Pat McGrath Midnight Sun. It's either this shadow or this shadow right here, and I think they both are in the same... I don't know which one of them duped it out, but I have it. And I'll, I'll link the video up there if I'm, if I'm feeling frisky. Okay, so I have the Exploders collection. So let's go ahead and verify that I have all of them here. I think I got them all. Looks like there is seven in total. So there's Runts, um, Everlasting Gobstopper, 
Nerds. Is it marshmallow pillows? Yep. Pixie sticks. Swudge. And um, Kazookles. Okay, and then this is the Galaxy X, Galaxy Dust Shifters. There's seven in this collection, and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one of these doesn't belong. Let me figure out which one doesn't belong. Thalassic. Yep, that's not in there. So I have all seven of those. I know that this is just one that I added because I don't have anything like it. So this is just a shimmer. It's, it doesn't belong to any collection though. Oh, there's Hemisphere. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, actually now that I think about it, I think there is nine. There's nine of these. Aurora flares, the multi-chromes. Okay, found another one from the Wizard of Oz collection. Oops, I don't think it's available anymore, but it is called, I'll get you my pretty. <laughs> I just wanna, I just wanna, I can see why they discontinued it. It's just not quite doing the shadow justice. Like in the pan, it looks really, really pretty, but it just leaves a little bit, you know, left to be desired. So I wonder if they're just like gonna discontinue that and start up something else. Chrome. Where did these come from? Oh, I think I got like some sort of bundle. And your little dog too. That's definitely <laughs> Wizard of Oz. Where did that go? Anyways, not really sure. This is Criminal. I didn't know that I even had this shade. Gallius. All right, just kind of a quick collection update. There are two that are not found in the... Um, galaxy dust shifters and that is centaurus and toucana which i've used quite a bit on my channel so just to let you guys know there is actual a total of nine of these galaxy dust shifters so the rest of these i'll go ahead and get them located into a pile and then we'll get we'll get to you know putting it all away okay there's a blue bash batch harmony collection which contains the shades. Um, I'm just a dandelion that's discontinued. Then there's Slow, Inara, Candy, Commercial, Cupid, Jaded, Mist, Naval, STFU, and Verity. Actually, I don't think I have any of those shades. I must not have gotten them, but just to let you know it's discontinued. Okay, and then lastly, I've got the Multichrome Madness is, I think, what the bundle is called. Yeah, it's a Multichrome Madness. It's got Nacarat, Pavonian, City, Thalassic, and Gallus. These right here, I believe, are just extra. This... Yeah, it's just extra, and criminal is also extra. So we've got everything um, sorted out into bundles, and now we can assemble the bundles so that I can group everything and use it accordingly. After cleaning out the magnetic sheet, I think I'd like to start by assembling the, I think it's Galaxy Dust. I think it's my biggest collection that I actually own. And I'll just start by doing it first. I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to section these off just yet. Of course, you've already seen this. You don't even need me. See, and I don't really care for how that looks. So let's... Go ahead and do, there's nine of them, so we're going to have one sticking out, it looks like. All right, there we go. The next one that I want to do that is going to be clearly distinguished is going to be my iridescent, which this is the Halo Moon collection, I think it is. So that'll go right here, and I'll come from this side, I guess. And I'll put those right here. 
Do they look somewhat different? Good, okay. And then we'll put in the Aurora flares, which again look very different than... <laughs> oh yeah, I was going to swatch. So this one here, it's I think it's Messier, and it's Asteria. This would be hard to see with this type of lighting. But we can still put it like on our fingers. And there's Kazookles. It's pretty fiery. Okay, let's go ahead and get the Aurora flares put in. There's nine of them, so we'll go ahead and stop right here as this one lines up, and then we'll start here. What do you think? No, I think this should go down. There should be nine. I believe there should be nine. And actually, I have a Davina palette, so if not all of these fit in kind of with gaps, you know, to signify the differences in collections, then I'll go ahead and move these over. But the, this one should have a ninth, I believe. Let me see what I'm missing. Here it is. It's right here. Exosphere. Come on now. There we go. Okay. Maybe, nah, let's do it that way. I think that probably looks the best. We're, we're definitely not. <laughs> we're not really going to get very far. Okay, next. I'm putting in the, what is it? Duochrome thingy majigs. This is my favorite. This is uh, Mystic Moon Pie. And you guys have seen this swatch like probably a million times. Don't ask me why. I don't even like pink. And here I am. This is my favorite one. And it's pink and blue. And those are my least favorite. Sweetie Sunbeam. Look at that puppy. That one's pretty. All right. And then we'll do... These don't really look... These do kind of look similar to that other group. So I may end up switching them out. We'll see. So we'll kind of put it like right there. Ah, uh, we might have problems. Mm, that's not gonna look good. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to move these up a little farther, don't I? Like just have like ever so slight gap, right? I can do that. And as long as they're not touching, then it will... And the ones that are touching, we all know that they belong in the same group. There. That kind of gives me a little more space. I know for some people it's like, no, you can't do it that way. But for me, it's like, well, I kind of can. All right. Then I've got this group right here. We don't have enough room to do this, which is what I wanted to do. I wonder if I can just put them all in oops order. So like this right here is a group. Right? And then this is a group. Right? They're not color coded. They're just coded by their group. And then come from this side. Right? A little bit more organization. It makes a little bit more sense. And then no matter what, I have to come from this side. None of them have more than nine, right? So this is the only one oops, that's going to have a second row. Right? Then you've got this group out here that can come this way. I 
I guess if you put these right here, you're going to know that they're not part of the Aurora flares. They're part of a different multi-chrome bundle. And then, let's say I come in from this side with this. Oh, this is interesting. Okay. That works. Now, I've I, so this one's discontinued. I really probably won't even include this in the collection anymore because it's like, what for? This maybe I should start a discontinued collection palette where everything that's discontinued, you just put it in this little palette and then you can pull from it as like a last resort. I might do that actually. And then that way I kind of, I don't know. But for now, let's put them all in, let's put all of our eggs in one basket. Or I really wanted to avoid having these two collections really close to one another because I can't tell, they look like, you know, you could confuse the collections a little bit. So I just, like, you can't really confuse the Halo Moons with the Aurora Flares. That's, I feel like that's fairly obvious, right? You can't really, what is this? Oh, wow. That's Skyla. That needs to go in here. Then I thought, well, if I do the iridescence, so then I can just do this. But here's my issue. I can't have this touching. I can't tell where anything goes. And then this is Tucana, which it, I believe it goes up here. Does that look okay? I feel like if I had this one right here in the collection, maybe it'd be okay. Actually, this group down here could probably be like up here. Just because I need something that has a different texture, different color, different everything. to differentiate between the two these collections because some of them are very difficult for me to tell the difference between okay those have all been moved up we'll just go ahead and put these these are just singles they don't belong to any collection they were gaps when I was you know buying singles that I felt this one I've always known as a single so like all of these kind of go into it so I guess not the most aesthetically pleasing however I feel like it's the most usable for somebody who needs to be able to access, you know, shadows. And there you have it. Thanks so much for joining me on this episode. I can't wait to see you guys in my next video. Like and subscribe on your way out if you enjoy this type of content. Bye. See you tomorrow.